One looked like a barber shop. Another looked like a church. But for some lucky birds on the South Shore, they might soon be called home. And that was the whole point. For 15 years, South Shore Habitat for Humanity has been selling birdhouses. It's one of its major fundraisers in the Braintree Agency's efforts to build affordable housing on the South Shore. Starting on Friday, April 25th, people came from all over the state to South Shore Plaza in Braintree to browse and to buy fancy birdhouses made by local artists. So tell me, what are you, what are you looking for today? I'm um, looking for a birdhouse that's uh, squirrel proof, but, oh, yeah. but I have two little girls, two and four, so they would kind of like something that kind of, a birdhouse that looks kind of neat, so not just a plain one, but I see lots to choose from here. So Yeah, and what, uh, what, do, you, what do you think they're going to like? Um, I think they might like something like um, the sea related yeah. one, the ocean, that sort of thing. So I see some ones with shells as well. Probably something like that. Everybody's doing it because we want to help house the next family. And right now we've got a house on Glen Rose and Braintree that is just about wrapping up. We're about to break ground in Hingham, Stoughton, Brockton, Marshfield, and we're 22 years old, South Shore Habitat for Humanity. We've helped about 170 children and 55 adults. And um, how long did it take you to, uh, to decorate that? Probably about an hour, not too long. Oh, that's not too bad. Have you sold um, any birdhouses for Habitat before? Yes. Yes, this is my third year of donating Your third year. Houses. So how many have you built? One each year? Oh, I have about three or four here this year. Three or four? Yes. I did it with my church. I organized a little painting party and we donated about 20 birdhouses. And where I live at Great Brook Condos in Norton, we got together and painted a few and donated those as well. How many would you say have been uh, donated for this? For the sale? Oh, between 25 and 30, I would guess. Wow, and how many people were involved in, in doing all that work? Probably about 20 people. Well, that's great. Right. That was a fun thing to do. So I've been here for about seven or eight years. And so you've seen, how many times have you come to the show? Every year? Every year. Yeah? yeah every What's year. your favorite part of it? Oh, I love all the little birdhouses. They're all so individual. And it helps the, um, the Habitat for Humanity that they're sponsoring. And so, have you bought birdhouses? Before? I have bought a couple in the past. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. you think you're going to buy one this year? I think I'm going to buy one this year, maybe yeah. a couple. A couple, yeah. wow. Do you have a, a big a big yard to keep them in? We have a very big yard to put them on. We have several different ones on our trees, so yeah. And um, who benefits most from this, you or the uh, or Habitat? Probably both. Probably both? <laughs> Probably both. What do you get out of it? Oh, I just what like it out of all the individualities of the birdhouses that people made. I think they're just very fascinating and some of them are very cute and you know it's, it's nice. It's a nice program. We're on our way to the Cape and just stopped to do some shopping and to check out the birdhouses. Oh that's great. Have you ever seen this before? No I haven't. So no. what is your impression? Very very impressed with the variety of designs and styles. Such creativity. It's really fun to well, I, we keep changing our mind on which one we're buying. The one that I think is the cleverest is not practical for our needs, but I'm still voting on it for my favorite. But well, what's practical for your needs? I want a hanging one. Okay. And I like this one that's the whole yard and would be better seated someplace. I think that's adorable. That it's so there's nowhere to, to place this particular one? Right, exactly. And there's so many others that... I could choose easily to serve the purpose I'm uh -huh. looking for. So. Do you have a big yard to... Uh, Actually, uh, it's a gift for some people that collect them, so oh, really? we're looking for a unique one. Oh, very good. They, and who knows, maybe I'll end up with one for myself, too. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. Very clever, very good.